Meanwhile, the Chinese company that is working on the Dasu hydropower project in Pakistan has decided to suspend the work at the site. This after a blast in Pakistan killed several engineers, including nine from China. The company named China Rezuba Group Corporation has cited security concerns for their decision. On the 14th of July, a bus crashed into a ravine after a blast in the Khyber Pakhtunwas Upper Kohistan district, resulting in deaths of at least about 13 people, while 28 others were injured. The explosion took place when the bus was actually on its way to Dasu, ferrying Chinese and Pakistani workers to an under-construction tunnel site in the remote district. Islamabad previously had blamed the blast on a mechanical failure that led to a gas leak. But China has described this as a clear case of bombing. Beijing has also called on Islamabad to strengthen security for its Chinese nationals working in Pakistan. Now, as quoted by news agency CGGC in a statement owing to the explosion attack that occurred on the 14th of July 2021, which has caused extremely heavy casualties, CGGC Dasu management has been forced to suspend the construction of the Dasu hydropower project. The project envisages the construction of a hydroelectric power plant on the Indus River. The Dasu Electric project is part of China-Pakistan Economic Corridor, which is a $65 billion investment plan under Beijing's ambitious Belt and Road Initiative. The Beijing, remember, has poured billions of dollars into Pakistan in recent years to boost the nation's infrastructure. Chinese engineers and Pakistani construction workers have been working on the project now, all but most of the essential Pakistani workers are believed to have been laid off. Meanwhile, China has also asked Pakistan to bring the perpetrators of the attack to justice. Pakistan's Interior Minister Sheikh Rashid has confirmed that a 15-member Chinese team was involved in the ongoing investigation, which has now reached its final stage. He also confirmed speaking with his Chinese counterpart, Li Qiang about the ongoing investigations, adding that the country's top security institutions were investigating into the incident. The 15-member Chinese delegation visiting Pakistan comprises of the representatives from ministries of foreign affairs and commerce, criminal investigation and technical experts. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.